pickled roasted peppers. So today I'm gonna make pickled roasted peppers. It's a take on Mama Lil's. Okay, so here is a cool way to cut the bell pepper that you might not know. Here. And then you just wanna roll it. Let me go on this way. There you go. Beautiful Aloha bell peppers. Now, if you wanna just take the skin off, here's what you can do. Cover. Also, by the way, if you have a gas stove, it's just way easier to put it on top of that. It's way quicker. Or if you have a grill, obviously. The skin should peel right off. Just like that. And there we go, we've got a roasted red pepper. Actually gives off this liquider here. That's really good for a red eye gravy, is what they call it. A non-reactive pan, just like this. Hello Kitty olive oil. Peppers in. Garlic. Okay, once your peppers have softened up like this right here, now we can go ahead and add in all the other stuff. Mediterranean oregano. Take it in one hand, then you rub it together with the other hand to sort of grind it up. Black pepper. Also, you guys always ask me where I got this pepper grinder. I got it at a thrift shop for about a dollar. Salt. Remove from the heat. Then you're just gonna add in red wine vinegar. I've got plum wine vinegar, so I'm gonna add that in. This is all to taste, by the way. Okay, so here they are, the pickled roasted peppers. Uh, these are just like a take on Mama Lil's. If you've ever had that brand, they're really delicious. Try them out. Uh, but yeah, these are really good on pretty much anything. I'm gonna use them on a pizza video. So stay tuned, that's gonna be the next video after this. Uh, these are great. You can hold them in the fridge for months at a time. They're preserved. I mean, remember, they're pickled, so it's a preserve. So you can hold it for quite a while. And uh, let's go ahead and try this out first. Delicious. Actually, it tastes like pizza. See you in the next one.